story about why I bought this car um, about 11 years ago I bought a Dodge Challenger it was a 2006 and it was my first sporty car um, it wasn't the souped up version it was just the base model but it looked cool um, and it was my first buy so that was exciting I paid it off um, I fell in love with not having a car payment so I kept it for as long as I could I've wanted this body, this model um, of the Dodge Challenger for as long as it's been out. Um, but 2018 was the year that I decided that was the year I was going to trade in my old car, get this new car, and I made that goal happen, which I'm super happy about. Um, have a car payment again, but that's okay. They gave me a really good deal, so it's not too much. My car insurance, however, did go up a bit. Um, some people say, you know, Angel, you know, you've wanted this car for so long, it's so sporty, why not get the RT or, you know, the Hellcat, something a little bit more racier, faster. And the main reason is because of insurance. I just I can't justify paying so much on car insurance just because the car goes a little bit faster. It sounds a little bit meaner. Um, that's not to say that in, you know, two years I don't trade up and go ahead and get that meaner looking car, meaner sounding car, um, which could very well happen. Um, just because I'm still craving that noise of the engine when I start it, which I'm not really getting with this car. But I do love this car. Um, I picked up my car about an hour ago, and then I decided to bring it up the mountain, as you can see in the background. Pretty cool, huh? Towers on this side. just saw this guy hand glide like literally run off the cliff and hand glide off the mountain which was so cool I have footage of that I'll roll that for you guys to see but he's getting so much air right now it's ridiculous Crazy. Here, I'll see if I can show it to you. Well, I wanted to give you a preview of the car, the new car, Dodge Challenger 2018. They did a full hood for me as well, and then the side panels, and then the mirror, which should protect it pretty well. Um, show you the inside of the car. Start the car up for you. It's pretty cool. And I can't get over this view. It's just amazing out here. So I'll show you the back of the car. Um, 
The wheels are pretty cool. They're stock wheels. They're black. I was thinking of painting the brake pads red, but everyone tells me don't do that. I was thinking of making the top black. Just wrap it with black. Um, but I'm not sure about that yet either. So we'll see. Um, the back's cool. Once I get my license plate, it'll be even better. So yeah, that's the full car.
to thank I want to thank everyone for watching today's vlog. I did a little bit more talking. I hope in the future that I, you know, get more comfortable with the camera and interact a little bit more with you guys um, and just kind of tell the story along with the ride, which I think will be a lot more fun. Um, so tomorrow I head to Vegas for the SEMA show. I'm gonna bring you along, show you some of my favorite cars. I'm a car person, so I love, 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 love cars. Um, so I'll bring you along for that. Until then, I will see you tomorrow. Have a great day, a great evening, and a wonderful morning. See you then.